Hi all, welcome to another video of the subject power system analysis based on KTU syllabus and we are on module 5 and uh, this video uh, actually we are focusing on one more problem uh, from the module 5 okay we have discussed uh, two different problems in the uh, previous video okay the problems from the module 5 so here also we are uh, dis uh, discussing another uh, variety of a problem so assume that the fuel input in BTU, BTU is British Thermal Unit, okay, British Thermal Unit BTU per hour for unit 1 and 2 are given as F1, F2, okay, like this. The maximum and the minimum loads on the unit are 100 megawatt and 10 megawatt respectively. Determine the minimum cost of uh, generation when the uh, following load is supplied, okay. The cost of fuel is rupees 2 per million BTU, okay, the cost of fuel, okay, is rupees 2 per million BTU. So we have to find the uh, minimum cost of generation okay when the load curve is like this so from the fuel input characteristics we know that that is f1 and ft is given so we, uh, we are finding df1 by dp2 df1 by dp1 and df2 by dp2 that is incremental cost of production df1 by dp1 we will get just like this df2 by dp2 okay by simply differentiating the values and when load is 50 megawatt okay what happened that is we are considering the first part that is 12 am to 6 am part okay what happens there so when the load is 50 megawatt uh, the economic loading can be find using by equating the uh, incremental cost of production that is df1 by dp1 equal to df2 by dp2 so this equation will be equal to this one okay and also we are having the total load is 50 so the p1 plus p2 is equal to 50 so we are having two equations df1 by dp1 is equal to df2 by dp2 okay in that we are substituting the values as like this and we are getting the equation 1 here and p1 plus p2 is equal to 50 so by solving these two equations we will get p1 as 15.65 megawatt and p2 as 34.375 megawatt and uh, if we are substituting these values of p1 and p2 in the equation of f1 f1 and f2 we will get the values of f1 as 210.868 million BTU per hour and f2 as 373.5 million BTU per hour okay and uh, also uh, we are considering the second case that is 6 am to 6 pm the total load is 150 megawatt okay so when load is 150 megawatt the equations are df1 by df2 is equal to df2 by db2 so the same equation that is the same equation we are having here also and uh, the only change is total uh, the required uh, amount of power is p1 plus p2 is equal to 150 instead of this 50 so here it is 150 by solving these two we will get p1 as 78.126 megawatt and p2 as 71.874 megawatt and uh, if you are substitu substituting these values of p1 and p2 in the equation of f1 and f2 we will get the fuel cost okay f1 as 851.496 million BTU per hour f2 is equal to 757.87 million BTU per hour okay so uh, in the third case that is 6 pm to uh, 12 uh, am we are the total consumption is also 50 megawatt so these two areas are same that is 6 here for 6 hours it is 50 megawatt and here also for another 6 hours it is 50 so totally for 12 hours we are having a 50 megawatt and uh, another for another 12 hours we are having 150 megawatt okay 50 and 150 so uh, we are if you are finding the total cost that is f1 plus f2 that is 210.868 plus 373.5 plus this f1 and f2 plus 815.496 plus 757.87 okay we will get the total cost so these all are per hour so we are having uh, we know that mm, okay uh, so in these two loads two different loads the end of system work for 12 hours that is for uh, 50 megawatt load uh, the system works for 6 plus 6 12 hours and for 150 megawatt load it also works for another 12 hours okay so all these are per hour okay all these costs are for per hour so we have to multiply the factor of 12 here the total for for, for finding the total cost okay f1 plus f2 plus this f1 plus f2 into 12 okay into 12 okay 
and uh, we have to multiply another time 2 also we have to use 2 also because the amount okay the cost of fuel is rupees 2 per million BTU so we have to multiply 2 also so the total cost we obtain it as 52,649.61 okay so that's about the problem i hope all of you understand well so thank you